Jayalalitha will stand trial for not filing income tax returns for three years in her capacity as a partner of Shashi Enterprises, which she jointly owned with her aide Sashikala. The Tamil Nadu Chief Minister is expected to appear before the trial court based on the orders given by Justice K.S. Radhakrishnan of the Supreme Court. Jayalalitha along with Sashikala set up Sashi Enterprises, wherein neither the enterprise nor its, nor its both partners filed their income tax return for the years 1991-92, to 92-93 as well as 93-94. to Jayalalitha had contended that since there was no income from the enterprise, therefore there was no tax evasion and not filing the income tax return was not an offence. The IT department, however, alleged that they had committed offences punishable under provision of the Income Tax Act of 1961. In January, the Supreme Court dismissed the appeals against the order of the Madras High Court, which had dismissed their discharge petitions. It had also asked the lower court to complete the trial in four months. This particular case has been going on and pending for quite some time now. However, Jayalalitha has decided that finally she will go ahead and try to put an end to it. She's expected to appear in the trial court today based on orders by the Supreme Court. Uh, crucial day, no doubt, for uh, Jay Lalitha there, of course, that uh, this is with regard to the case that has been haunting her for several years. Uh, the one where she, uh, in fact, has been accused of not filing income tax returns on an enterprise that she had formed along with her then aide, Sashikala. Of course, uh, we will have to wait and watch to see exactly how this will turn out for the Tamil Nadu chief minister, who has been going ahead and stating that she is innocent.